Hello everyone. <coughs> Hello everyone. Welcome to the Mathematics of my channel. In this video, we are going to solve this interesting integral. Integral from 0 to infinity. Sin of sx over e to the 2 pi x minus 1 dx. Well, how to begin? Okay, uh, as a first step, uh, here 0 to infinity. Now I am going to multiply both numerator and denominator by e to the minus 2 pi x. So we have here e to the minus 2 pi x times sine of s x over here uh, we know 1 minus e to the uh, minus 2 pi x dx. Well, uh, then here 0 to infinity e to the minus 2 pi x times uh, sine of s x then 1 over 1 minus e to the minus 2 pi x uh, we can represent uh, as a infinite series so we have n is equal 0 to infinity e to the minus 2 pi n x uh, here dx okay then here uh, e to the minus 2 pi x here e to the minus 2 pi n x so we can uh, simplify here uh, integral from 0 to infinity sine of s times x then uh, here sum of n is equal 0 to infinity e to the now we can take minus 2 pi x as a common factor so here we have n plus 1 times dx okay then uh, as a next step i'm going to uh, shift the index so here we have sine of sx then here uh, we can take n is equal 1 to infinity e to the minus 2 pi n x dx okay then uh, we can switch the integral sign and sigma notation so we have n is equal 1 to infinity integral from 0 to infinity now we have uh, e to the minus 2 pi nx times sine of sx dx. Well, uh, let's recall the uh, very famous integral. Integral from 0 to infinity e to the minus ax e to the minus a times x a greater than to 0 times sine of bx dx. So, uh, we know the answer b over a square plus b square so now we have uh, this type of uh, integral here so we can write now uh, our integral i so uh, i is equal to infinite sum n is equal 1 to infinity uh, now here we have b b uh, we know uh, s instead of b we have s a we know uh, 2 n phi so we can write here uh, s over uh, 4 times n square phi square plus s square okay now i think uh, this infinite sum uh, familiar with us because uh, we solved this uh, sum uh, in a previous video so this is the sum uh, sum of n is equal 1 to infinity 1 over n square plus x square is equal to pi x minus 1 over 2 times x square plus pi over x times e to the 2 pi x minus 1 i will add the link in the description and also make a card so uh, to apply uh, this infinite sum uh, in the numerator we should have one so uh, before they apply we can rearrange uh, our sum so we can take uh, s over 4 times pi square uh, as a factor so here n is equal 1 to infinity uh, now we have 1 over n square plus s over 2 pi perfect square okay then we can apply uh, this sum so we can write uh, this is equal to s over 4 times uh, phi square then uh, here we have pi x minus 1 so pi times x now we know s over 2 
times pi so s over 2 times pi minus 1 over 2 times x square so 2 times x square over 4 times uh, phi square plus here we have pi over x x we know s over 2 times pi then uh, e to the 2 pi x again we know s over 2 times pi here minus 1 okay uh, let's simplify so here uh, now we have we know uh, s over 4 times phi square then here uh, this pi get cancelled so here we have s minus 2 s minus 2 over uh, here we have uh, you know uh, this 2 over 2 4 so this 2 this 4 also get cancelled and here we have s square over pi square we can write here uh, pi square then uh, plus here uh, we can simplify 2 times uh, 2 times pi square over s times uh, here this 2 pi get cancelled so e to the s minus 1 okay then uh, we know this phi square phi square phi square get cancelled so uh, also this s get cancelled then we can take one half uh, as a factor so if we take one half uh, here uh, we have uh, we know uh, 1 over e to the s minus 1 then uh, we can divide it by this s so here we have plus 1 half minus 1 over s okay this is the answer if you like this type of videos please subscribe this channel thank you for watching